Hakkar the Soul Flayer, one of the pantheons worshipped by the trolls, a cruel and evil blood god. In the lore he was called upon by the Gurubashi and other troll tribes desperate for power, but his demand for sacrifices and unsatiable bloodthirst for offerings was out of control. He's a boss you can fight, Yasira now guards his turn. Most destructive finishers are all about damage, Ragnaros hurling molten fire, Barangeddon inflaming the battlefield. How about one that sustains you? He's 8 mana, 9-6, at the end of your turn drain 1 health from all enemies to your hero. That means the damage dealt is restored to your hero's health. Kinda like Mistress of Pain but a mini aerial effect. The more minions and targets, the more health you drain. Next up, this is somewhat like Gormok and Rend Black Hand, a strong effect with conditions but a bloody tribute theme. He's 7 mana, 3 11, Battlecryer destroy 2 random friendly minions to silence and destroy an enemy minion. So if you have a deck full of tokens and death yeah. minions, you can really abuse this. Completely eliminating a key big minion can really be worth it. Defender of Argus as well and other boosters can go well with his large health pool. Do you remember the corrupted blood incident? Entire servers of dead players. Well, this is the craziest one by far. It's similar to Miscall or Reverse the other way with a corruption thing. He's 10 mana, 1111. Battle cry, sacrifice half your health. Tain all enemy minions, hand and deck included. I wanted to call this corrupt, but such a card already exists. What does Taint do? At the end of your owner's turn, deal 1 damage to the owner and 1 damage to self. This only triggers once they're on the board, slowly killing them. Which Hakkar be on legendary, sucking the blood out of all enemies, tributing minions to completely obliterate a foe, or tainting every enemy minion hand and deck. Last time we had Gengreymain, the old Wolf King version 3 one. I'll nerf him to 7 mana as many of you requested. Next up we got a certain lady replacing the priest hero Anduin. Who could it be? Guys, I've now got a sponsor, G2A. You can get a discount on all games by using the rfuller code. There's links below, check them out. When you attack, you have to pick which hero, so who will you focus down first? Lastly, this can easily be configured for the mobile for the 2v2 experience.